Mm-hmm. What do you say? Is that character our stowaway? I felt no guilty energies at all, Amazon. My planet is Toledo Lega in the Sava Group. My legal name is Ganagas Gaktos, but I prefer you use my nickname, Ganga. Thank you. Gotta be this one. I'm from Sazi of the Sava System, Einswai. My code number is... Wrong! What? I know I'm the stickhead! You dirty stinking... Hold butt. on, I was lying deliberately as a way of testing him. Forgive me, I'm sure you understand. Glenn Groff is my name. Planet Ash White and the Seguru Alliance is my home. Well, who's the 11th man? Which one of us is lying? Nobody lied. No one lied? Somebody had to. Maybe they actually did assign us an extra person. But for what reason? Nonsense! Huh? Well, then what? Believe me, I'm as mystified as anybody. My extrasensory perception has never failed me before. You haven't yet identified yourself. It's possible that you're the mystery person. I'll tell you who I am. Please do. I'm Tadados Lane, known as Tada of Siberis on Terra. Not being a psychic, I have no way of knowing whether you're lying or not. Now we're back at square one again. We didn't learn anything. He's right. Every single one of us could have been lying for all we know. Before we do anything, we'd better check the ship. We need to know if there's anyone hiding in the shadows waiting to sabotage us. Did I miss something? When we elect butthead jerk captain? King Mayan is entirely qualified to lead us. He was educated by some of the most brilliant scholars of our time. <laughs> what happened? Why did my intuition fail me? Cheer up, kid. We'll run through this exam like a dose of salts. Come on. Hmm? <laughs> These are the crew quarters. I've lived in cities that were smaller than this. This is one classy barroom. Wow, everything's premium. Really mellow aging, too. Hi there. Hey, mind if I hold a mirror under your nose to see if you're still breathing? A mirror? Oh, never mind. Nothing mysterious about that. It's likely you have seen it before. It's a very well-known work of art by the famous Terran sculptor Romo. Many Terran ships display replicas. I suspected this ship was from Earth. Hey, look! The arrow's missing from the bow. I wonder what happened to it. Nothing. Romo's original vision was that of a warrior with no arrow in his bow. I think it's a symbol of peace. It all has a feeling of strength. And courage. A quiet kind of power. Huh. Can you read the inscription, Chaco? It's an expression of gratitude to the crew of this ship. Looks like ancient English. Well, can you read it? Yes, there's a prayer for the ship's safety. Wishing hope for the brothers and sisters aboard the Esperanza and a safe journey to the new world. Huh? The Esperanza. I remember that. But how could I possibly remember something that I've never seen or even heard of before? Let's move on. There's an elevator over here. Hmm. 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 
Uh oh. Hey, what are you doing? Give me a straight answer now, and don't joke around about it. About what? Would you say you're an average Terran? Because we're very near the exact same height. What are you talking about? Your arms are a little longer. My shoulders are wider, too. Yeah, and look at our feet. Yours are a lot larger. You'd better go see a psychiatrist. Oh! <laughs> hey! I don't know how this antique works. I can't even find a switch. There should be a pressure plate right in front of the door. Yes. There it is. What do you know? He's right. I guess he's psychic after all. Maybe he has been here before. Move on. Tata, should we go up or down? Down. So can you tell us where we're going? The engine room. The topmost section quartered all the passengers. How do you know? I don't, but I have a feeling. Why aren't there any lights? I guess the electrical system needs repairs. Hey, is that the engine room? Ew, it's creepy in there. I can't see. The light switch is on the wall to your right, just inside the passageway. I've got it. Ah! <laughs> no! I'm not scared. It just hurts my eyes. It looks like a jungle. Very strange. Hey, <laughs> they look like conductor vines. Conductor what? Vines that conduct electricity. They've been neglected, so they're overgrown and starting to go to seed. Hmm. Oh, oh, conductor vines. What the heck are those? They're plants with a very high mineral content, first discovered by the Saguruns. They're not man-eaters, Fro. You don't have to be afraid. Hmm. That's very funny, Mr. Big Mouth. I wasn't scared, I was just startled. This is the biggest storage bay I've ever seen. They stocked it with just about everything anybody could ever need. Yeah, but there's also tons of junk no one would ever want. How could they be so wasteful? Who knows? Man, this sure is heavy. <clears throat> need a little help? I can handle it. Hmm. Hmm? Are you crazy? I was just curious. Your skin isn't as soft as mine. Do you know that? I've never met anyone so weird in my life. Oh. Watch it, huh? This thing's packed to the brim. Three crates of them. Tata found them. But of course. They call these babies stun guns, but if the regulator is set at maximum, they're powerful enough to kill a rhinoceros. Yeah? It's just what we need. You mind telling me just what we need them for? If that 11th person becomes a threat to our lives, we'll have to defend ourselves with any weapon available to us, because we may be talking life and death here, Ganga. Don't you understand that? But weapons never help. Our history proves they only escalate dangers. I have to agree with Ganga. None of us trust each other yet. Let's take a vote on it. Oh. Well? An excellent suggestion, New. How many think we should carry guns? Two, three, four, five. You mean you're against the idea, Tata? Hmm. Now then, all those opposed to having weapons? <gasps> Six to five. Pack all the guns and take them to the main cabin locker room. I have to admit, your vote was really surprising. You voted like a butthead jerk. Froll, are you some kind of gun nut? I'm deadly with one of these beauties. Bam! Bam! Choo! Bow! Froll, I'm confused. Are you... Huh? What's wrong? You're starting to act like some kind of wuss. Sorry, but my brain is getting crazy images. Forget it. You're not a psychic, you're a psycho. Better let me get that, Froll. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, never mind. I got it! Be careful. You'll hurt yourself. Mm. Froll, don't be ridiculous.